Mistletoe, a symbol of love and fertility, and also probably the world's most beloved parasite. Parasitic plants are a bit of a conundrum. Most parasites have to be parasites because they have no other way of getting nutrients. These are known as obligate parasites. On the other hand, some organisms like the brain-eating amoeba can become parasites, but are naturally fully capable of free living without a host. These are known as facultative parasites. Mistletoe is weird. It's got green leaves, and if you've taken Bio 101, you know that that means it has chlorophyll and it can undergo photosynthesis. So that must mean it's a facultative parasite, right? Parasitizing because it can, not because it needs to. But mistletoe is an obligate parasite, specifically an obligate hemiparasite. See, though mistletoe can undergo photosynthesis all on its own, it lacks another key feature that other plants have roots. Instead, mistletoe has a hostorium. Mistletoe uses this to tap into its host tree to steal nutrients and water that it otherwise can't get itself.